Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, this is going to be a birthday haul. My birthday is actually on Saturday, February 15th. So I have been shopping. So this is actually part of the haul. I got this hat from Forever 21. I love it so much. I feel very Selena 90s-esque. So I love it so much. And that's why I'm rocking the red lip. Because I just feel very Selena with this hat on. So that's part of it. So I'm just going to jump right in because there's a lot of stuff. And also I'm rushing because I got to get to class. So... From Bath & Body Works, I got this Caribbean Escape Candle. It smells really delicious. It just smells very fruity and fresh like the ocean. Not like the ocean, but more like, like a really fruity, delicious drink that you would get. And then I got the candle holder. I believe this was like one of the ones that came out for holiday. No, actually this is new. <coughs> this is new for the spring because it has like these floral um, detailings. I thought this was really cute, only $8.50, and I've been looking for one of these to hold these big candles because it just looks a lot nicer when it's inside one of these holding things. And then I got another candle. This is watermelon lemonade. I've been drinking watermelon. <laughs> oh my God, it smells so good. Like It literally smells like a really sweet um, watermelon lemonade. Like It really, really smells like that. It smells exactly how it sounds. So that's what I got from Beth and Body. Now for Forever 21, actually this is a lot. I'm gonna do Urban Outfitters. I went to the went to the Westchester Mall. If you're wondering where I got all this stuff, I went from I went to Cross County on Friday because I was working at the Mac counter there, and then the next day I went to the Westchester Mall. Um, so that's both things. Well, the Cross County is in Yonkers, Westchester Mall is in Westchester. So um, okay, so at Urban Outfitters, I picked up these Dynamite Duo Perfect Sculpt sponges. Um, I love the cheaper beauty blender version sponges and these are cool because it's two different shapes only 10 bucks and I usually pay five dollars for one so I thought that was awesome and then I got this really adorable my little pony um, drinking glass and it was on sale for three bucks usually eight so I really like that I got this nail rock kit this is a really cool um, nail art design thing. It's normally $10. It was on sale for five. It comes with all of these like little um, crystals and rhinestones and then like the caviar nail art. It's similar to that. It comes with like a pink caviar. So I'm going to use this on my birthday because I'm going to do my own nail design because I never find a place that does it properly. So it shows you the steps in the back. Half of it is the pink nail polish and then you pour the caviar on top, the little nail grits, and then you glue on um, the little design so I'm gonna use that for my birthday and it's a perfect like raspberry pink which is great for this time of year for Valentine's Day and stuff and then last but not least for my birthday night I thought this was a great idea to pass around to everyone at the table it's the happy fucking birthday make your party pictures infinitely cooler with awesome party graphics on your photo so it's a disposable camera like the ones we had in the 90s if you were a 90s baby you definitely use these a lot as a kid before we carried around digital cameras we had these for you younger girls out there who don't know and I love Urban Outfitters. You find the coolest things there. Then from Forever 21, I have a whole bag of crap. I got all accessories and shoes because I didn't find any clothes I liked. I got this really pretty heart-shaped mirror. It's black. It was the last one they had. They had one on display that was pink, but I thought the black one was classier because the pink one was like see-through. Then I picked up these mint like little tennis sneakers. They were only 12 bucks. I love mint. I'm obsessed with mint. It's my favorite spring color. I love mint and coral. I think they're the best. So I got those. And then I got these shoes. It's really adorable. They're like sandal shoes with a nice pointed toe and they're like a nice camel color and These are really cute and really comfortable and I love the way it looks like a sweetheart cut So your feet will have like a sweetheart cleavage and I got both things in a size 9 just in case you're wondering um in yeah, in H&M, I believe I'm an 8.5. In Forever 21, I'm 9. It depends because my sh my feet are wide. And I like how they zip in the back. I usually don't go for shoes like this, but for the spring, when I want to be like running around in the park and stuff, it's a lot better to have something with a zipper so that I'm not, my, you know, I'm not like tripping over my own feet. I picked up some headbands. This is a really cute like purple turban. I love it because it has like this fuchsia purple glitter and it's really really cute 
I picked up some of these like little razors. I thought this was awesome. I usually just buy like real blades, but I thought that was cute since I was there and I needed some anyway. And then I also picked up some nail decals. I'm also gonna use these in conjunction with this to make my nail art design for my birthday. Also, the big black bow that I was wearing in my Instagram pictures, if you're not following my Instagram, is Gabriella Glamour. No 215, just the Glamour. Um, that big black bow I also got when I was shopping for all this stuff. I also picked up this mint purse, long crossbody bag, it was only 20 bucks. It's really, really adorable, it fits a lot of stuff inside, and look, it's a flowery print. Like I said, I love minty stuff, and obviously I won't be wearing all this stuff together, like all the mint stuff. Um, also picked up a mint nail polish, it's called Mint from Forever. And then I, pair, I picked up a pair of mint sunglasses, and I love these, these are very like retro Coachella, like hippie style. So that's everything from Forever. At Nordstrom, I picked up the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Foundation. I've heard so many things about this. I've been dying to try it. I'm not even going to bother opening it. You guys know what it looks like. I got the number 8 because I like my foundations darker. And also because spring and summer is coming, it's like why get a color that matches me now? I might as well get a darker one because that's that will last me all the way until next spring. Because my tan, you know, my tan tends to last longer. And I can use it now if I just mix like a drop of a lighter foundation. So I got the Luminous Silk Armani. I was counting the other, there's a store called Six. Um, and it's like an accessory store, kind of reminds me of like icing. I picked up this big cocktail ring. I'm probably gonna wear this on my birthday. This was $10, but they were having a sale. Four, four items, 40% off, three items, 30% off. So I got four things and I saved a lot of money. So I got that ring. I picked up these sunglasses. These are so cute. They're like cat eyes, but the entire like rim is like a felt material. So I thought that was really, really fancy. And those were 12 bucks. And I also picked up this bow ring, this two knuckle bow ring. Really, really cute with a stretchy elastic. And then I picked up this mint scarf. I love this scarf. It's a huge circle scarf. And I love these silver stars all over it. I think it's so, oh, you can't see it, it's on this side. The silver stars all over it. I think it's so pretty. And it's really, really lightweight. So I'm actually gonna be able to wear this in the spring and summer. Um, you know, on those summer nights where obviously it's not gonna get cold, but you might just feel a little breeze by the water. And it's a perfect kind of scarf because it's really lightweight. At Sephora, I went crazy with high-end stuff. I picked up the Marc Jacobs Face 2 brush. If you watch Julie G, she's been talking about this a lot. Um, and I love the way she applied the foundation with it. And I was like, yeah, I need this in my life. So I'll probably do a video using this, like a demo and review. It's a really, really great face brush. If you want to see more of what it looks like, just Google it. Um, but like I said, I'll probably make a video about it. And then... I picked up the Urban Decay All Nighter Spray, also so that on my birthday my makeup will last all night. I love the All Nighter Spray, I really do think it works. Um, I stopped purchasing it because I don't really go out that often. I'm sorry, I keep looking this way because I want to see that I'm still recording so it doesn't stop on me. Um, I don't go out like that often like I used to when I was a teenager, so I don't tend to need it to last me, to last me all night, but I figured I need to get one anyway for my birthday. Um, and then I also picked up a Marc Jacobs lipstick in the color Strange Magic. It's a really, really, really... Did I just drop the... Oh, God. I just dropped the blade. In the color Strange Magic. It's a really beautiful, like, light pinky color. Let me just show it to you. I'm not going to swatch it yet because... I want it to be like brand new when I first use it. So this is the packaging. It's like a bullet. It kind of reminds me of the Guerlain lipsticks that look like a bullet. And it has a magnetic closure. So it's not going to open like your matte lipsticks in your purse. And I mean, duh. And it says Marc Jacobs. It's really pretty. So this is the color. This is called Strange Magic. It's like a really light, light pinky if you know about max in sync lip pencil it's like that color literally but in a lipstick and these are called lip gels so they're like a cream sheen finish from mac and then um i got the stila all day 
liquid eyeliner in the color turquoise it's basically like a mint color it says turquoise but it's really like a mint color I love mint eyeliner and then like black on top so that'll be my go-to spring look then I picked up a YSL lipstick um, this is my favorite YSL lipstick number 13 peach passion um, yeah so I picked that up I love it and what else did I get Oh, okay. So that's all I got from Sephora, even though it's expensive. So yeah, I went a little crazy, but definitely worth it because it's my birthday. It only comes once a year. And then I got a bunch of stuff from Michael Kors. This is the best part of my birthday haul, guys. So on the day that I went to Cross County, I went to Macy's Elma Girl Met in the neon pink. I picked it up for myself. This bag. so, so freaking excited, guys. So if you follow me on Instagram, you saw it already because I went crazy and posted a bunch of pictures. It's basically this purse right here. It's the perfect, like, nice medium size. If you look it compared to my head, it's the perfect size. And I'm a big girl, so it's the perfect size, I think, for like going to the park or going shopping. You can fit a water bottle, a water bottle, your cell phone, your wallet, your keys, maybe even a little lipstick. Like you can fit a lot of stuff in this purse. It's really, really roomy inside. I love it so much. I love the detailing right here. I just, oh, and I love the color. I'm obsessed. So I picked that up. I love, love, love this bag. And when I went to the Westchester yesterday with my boyfriend, I stopped into the Michael Kors store because we're passing by the Michael Kors store. And I'm like, babe, let's go in. Like, I want to see the watch in person. Like, I want you to see it, blah, blah, blah. So we're looking at the watches, we're looking at the watches. And first off, let me just tell you, they had this a scarf on sale, this $100 scarf on sale for $28 so we picked one of these up it's black it's really really pretty and it's like a simple nice woven texture and this will last a lot of years or a long time and then it has like this cute little like MK um, badge thing so anyway so we picked that up so looking at the watches and I see the price tag under it and it says 378 I think it said and I was like why does it say 378? Isn't this watch 550? So this guy comes over, Francisco. Shout out to him who helped us. And he's like, yeah, this watch is 550. And I'm like, oh, well, it says, what's that number there? Like, is that a badge number or something? And he's like, oh, no. It probably just went on sale, like, right now. And I'm like, what? Are you serious? Like, are you, like, what? He's like, yeah. Um. So, and then I'm like, Oh my god he's like you want to try it on I'm like no I want it like if it's on sale I want it right now so then he goes in the back turns out they had sold out because it literally had just got on sale and that was the last one they had but they had just put it on display so I'm like yeah I'll take it I don't care so I look at it it's completely like fine like it's perfect so long story short my boyfriend ended up buying it for me but it had turns out that he had already bought me it online but then when I went to um, when we went to pay for it there, he bought it for me again. Like he spent like a thousand dollars in like two days because he bought two watches, and I was like, I was so freaking touched, guys. Like he knew I wanted that watch for so long, and he couldn't get it for me last year, but now this year he got it, and like he bought it twice. I know he's gonna return the other one, but like my boyfriend bought it twice. Like what other guy would spend six hundred dollars on a watch and then buy it again? Like guys so let me show you the watch because you're gonna die it's freaking amazing oh my god so are you ready for the big reveal so the, the watches come like this in this michael kors box and are you ready oh my god it's so beautiful Look. this is what it looks like Zoom. So this is what it looks like as you can see there's crystals all over it even inside and then there's crystals on the watch's bracelet. Crystals all over it, all over the entire bezel, the bracelet, and the chains go all the way around. And then the very bottom just has like a link. But the entire watch is chained like that. And this watch is so beautiful, guys. Like, I don't even want to wear it. Like, I love it so, so freaking much. Um, the one I have now is the regular, like, this is the glitz or whatever it has the two rows of crystals with the regular band this one's a little smaller and then it has a chain um it's so beautiful guys they also have it in white and black and i think silver so so the birthday hauling wasn't complete after i finished that video that same day i went to sephora and i got a couple things again Ooh, 
So when I went to Sephora, it's up the Too Faced um, Sweethearts Perfect Flush Blush in the color Peach Beach. Love this so much. I'm wearing it right now. And I actually filmed myself doing this entire look using all of the new makeup I purchased and doing a first impression first impressions review on everything. So that will be included in that video. I just filmed it. Just filmed it literally right now. So and then I picked up NARS Casino Blush. I'm also wearing that, and that's part of the first impressions video as well. I always use Laguna. Um, like, literally love Laguna. I've been through, like, three of them. Literally, this is empty. Um, but I wanted to try the darker version because... Not the darker version, the, dark, the darker bronzer because um, I always find myself adding something else to make Laguna a little bit darker. So with this, I feel like I don't have to do that. And I like having a one-step bronzer contour um, for every day when I just want to get my makeup done in 10 minutes and get out of the house for school. <clears throat> and then I also picked up the NARS um, Kawaii Duo, which has this gorgeous metallic eyeshadow and purple. And I'm wearing those two right now, but I did a very, very light, light layer <clears throat> just um, to get a little sense of the color. I didn't want a lot because this is very, very pigmented. So I picked up those three things. Love, love, love them. So that is really the final video. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you so much. Thank you for um, sticking around for this whole video because I know it's kind of long. And stay tuned for the first impressions video where I will be doing my makeup and telling you all about all this new makeup that I talked about in this video. So I love you guys so much. Don't forget to stay glam and happy Valentine's Day. Mwah.